गाइस वेलकम बैक एंड आई एम अगेन हियर विद अ न्यू वीडियो एंड टुडे आई विल बी शोइंग अ वीडियो ऑन वन प्लस थ्री टी इन विच यू बी एबल टू रिटर्न योर वन प्लस थ्री टी टू स्टॉक एंड लॉक द बूट लोडर सो आई हैव सीन आई हैव सीन मेनी गाइस गेटिंग इश्यूज रिगार्डिंग डी एम वेरिटी सो टुडे आई थॉट ऑफ मेकिंग अ वीडियो टू शो यू गाइज हाउ टू रिटर्न योर डिवाइस टू स्टॉक एंड लॉक द बूट लोडर यूजिंग फास्ट बूट एंड ए डी बी सो दिस गाइड वॉज गिवन बाई वन ऑफ द एक्स डी ए डेवलपर नेम्ड एज द अंडर स्कोर रूटर सो आई हैव मैंशन द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन विलो यू कैन चेक इट आउट एंड टू डू दिस यू नीड टू हैव फ्यू फाइल्स विच आई हैव ऑल्सो मैंशन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन आई वंस शो यू दैट इज ओपो थ्री टी मेन ओ एस फाइल दैट इज फोर पॉइंट जीरो पॉइंट टू एंड फोर पॉइंट जीरो पॉइंट थ्री यू मे ऑल्सो रिक्वायर ऑफिशियल रिकवरी so uh, if you guys are rooted now and if you have twrp recovery installed this is for the process uh, this is for people who are rooted and they if they wanted to go back to the stock so to start with that first what we'll do is guys uh, first we'll go to recovery mode just reboot and you can use your volume button to go to recovery and once a device boots into recovery you just have to go to wipe click on advance and here select everything guys including internal memory so make sure you take a backup of your internal memory because uh, this process will delete everything from your device and you'll get a uh, stock device uh, after this process so once everything is done just swipe to wipe and now just go back and again reboot only recovery if you reboot to system your device won't boot up because there is uh, no system image available now so first do one thing reboot your device to recovery once more so if your device doesn't boot to recovery just power off your device once and go to fast boot mode after your device goes to fast boot mode you just have to do one thing you can use this recovery that is 3.1.0 this is the latest version of recovery so here you just type fast boot flash recovery and the name of the recovery dot img and hit enter once it is done just use your volume button to boot your device back to recovery now you should have twrp recovery installed on your device so you can see my device boots to uh, boots up to twrp recovery now i so i click here never show this screen during boot and click swipe to modify so now my twrp recovery boots up and here what i'll do is i'll first transfer the 4.0.2 file uh, which i have downloaded in my download folder so this is 4.0.2 i'll push it to my device and once it is done we'll flash it using twrp recovery so once the file is placed inside internal memory just click on this and swipe to confirm flash and after the process is complete we just wipe the caches go back and reboot system you will still get the issue dm verity so we'll see uh, in further steps you won't find this issue and or, or the message which is being displayed here so now your device boots up and uh, we'll just complete the setup wizard guys don't use your uh, gmail id or anything as of now because uh, we again have to flash uh, other firmware and you delete the internal memory so i just click on next and i skip everything now i go to settings and go to about here i have to tap seven times here so that i get the developer option available once this is done i just go to 
okay developer option and in this I'll enable USB debugging mode allow this computer okay so now this is done now we again uh, boot a device to TWRP recovery to do that press the power button and reboot and use your volume button again so next is will flash uh, official recovery of oneplus so I'll show you I have already downloaded the file and I go here and you can see I have recovery OPPO 3T so this is the official recovery guys will be flashing this recovery now so to flash this recovery just reboot your device back to fastboot mode so once your device boots into fastboot mode will flash this recovery with the same commands so I select here the same command and just write the name of the official recovery okay give me a minute okay I'll type the name of recovery here that is recovery underscore OPPO 3T and dot IMG so now I have official recovery installed on my device so what we'll do is we reboot to recovery now so once we enter here what I'll do I'll completely erase everything from my system now after this is done I go back so after your device uh, reboots will again complete the setup wizard so now we go to file manager and in this what we have to do is we just go to storage and locate TWRP so I don't have TWRP on this so it is clear uh, that it has been removed and I don't have any uh, file or folder available for this once I'll go to my system and also check whether it is available or not sometimes it doesn't display here so I select transfer file and you can see I don't have TWRP uh, folder available here so the next step is we'll be locking the bootloader now so to do that we again go to settings and enable developer option and from here we enable USB debugging so after this is done we grant permission and we boot a device to fast boot mode after this is done so after our device boots to uh, fast boot will give a command fast boot o action fast boot o e m lock and now hit enter so now you get a message of lock bootloader on your device so in this you have to select yes you can select using volume and once you select yes now press the power button now your device will boot up again and uh, after your device boots up I'll tell you the next process so after your device boots up we again complete the setup process and now we again go to settings and enable developer option and enable USB debugging okay I got a message I think it is not done so I click allow okay now after this is done we'll check whether uh, the device uh, the DM verity issue has been solved or not if it is not solved then we'll load the file using ADB the next version or the latest version of uh, software using ADB and after that we think the issue should have gone now we just 
reboot a device and we'll see whether DM Verity issue still exists or not. So it still exists. So what we do is we first we reboot to recovery mode now. And after this is done, we'll sideload using ADB. So I have also downloaded the latest version of uh, Oxygen OS. So for first, we, what we'll do is we'll flash this file that is Oxygen OS 4.0.3. So in this, we do ADB sideload here. Let me boot to install for ADB from ADB sorry ADB side load and we write the name of the file it is zip format so dot zip and hit enter So once the process is complete, uh, we just reboot a device and we'll see whether the DM Verity issue has been solved or not. And you can see you did not find any DM Verity issues. Now after everything is done guys, you can update your device to uh, the latest version that is 7.1.1. And I'm sorry guys, just it was a lengthy video because I had to do a few tries and now you can see the DM Verity issue was solved. So thank you once again guys, hope you like the video. Thanks for watching, have a great day.